Dexter Sneed, your daddy is fixing to have a fit. Good morning, Backup Dancers. Today is Wednesday, and I hope you're having a great hump day. Today, I have a friend coming over to the house to help me. Um, a lot of my chickens have bumblefoot. Bumblefoot is contagious. I've, in the time, the five years that I've had chickens, I've never had this many at one time have bumblefoot. So she's gonna come over and help me do surgery today. Also, the group home is coming today. The month of August is my downtime at Sneed's Farmhouse, meaning I'm really slow. People don't book tours in August because people are thinking about starting back to school and getting their kids ready and having school supplies and school clothes and they're not thinking about spending extra money at the petting zoo, right? So it's my slowest month. So Kayla and I have been trying to really rack our, rack our brain to think about what we can do to stay successful during off season. Off season is usually in August, but it's also in November, December, January, and February because it's cold. No one wants to be outdoors. People are going shopping and stuff like that. So Kayla and I are gonna create a shop on my website. Um, this is gonna be a work in progress. So I'm not really sure what all is gonna be on the shop, but I'm working towards things to keep myself afloat Look at my dog. What in the world? Are you rubbing on something? You silly goose. Taggy boy, you better potty. I'm taking him outside. Oh, the leash is wrapped around her leg. I'm sorry, sugar. All right, I fixed her leash. So, um, one thing that I would love to do, <laughs> just like I need something else added to my plate, but I want to do bees. I do. I don't know why. It's probably going to be a lot of work. I'm not sure. But one thing I would love to add to the shop is honey, fresh honey. I would love to be a local supplier for um, my community to have fresh honey. Um, other things I think about is I would love to have a necklace that says the word dance on it have no idea how to do that. I don't know where to begin to even contact someone about making a necklace. And I don't want it a cheap necklace. I want something that's not going to turn, that's not going to break. But I found this necklace on Facebook that's pearls. And you can put any name that you want to in the middle. And I was like, that's it. That's what I want. Now, Granted, the next the necklace on Facebook is 60 bucks, right? So like that's expensive, but I want the necklace to be an investment um, because with the word dance to me is not a cheap word when it comes to Snead's Farmhouse. Dancing is sometimes hard work because you got to figure out what shoes to put on in the morning to dance. I talk about dancing in my lives that are on Mondays and Wednesdays at 7. And if you don't join my lives, I hope that you'll give us the opportunity to listen, to learn how to be the best version of yourself. So the group home and I today are going to be putting out feed. That's what's on the agenda. And we're also gonna move Queso's enclosure to give him some fresh grass. I have taken the dogs in. Now I'm waiting on the group home. But the word dance is an investment. It doesn't come natural to dance every day. What do I mean by the word dance? Dancing is, you know, you have choices in life. You can sit it out or you can dance. That's also a song that means a lot to me. It reminds me that in order to be the best version of myself, sometimes I have to get out of my comfort zone. Sometimes I have to force myself to get up. Sometimes I have to do things that are uncomfortable to get myself to dance. But I feel like the word dance doesn't come lightly when it comes to Sneed's Farmhouse. So when I think about this perfect necklace for my shop, I think about it being an investment. Oh, look who's, look who's driving up. It's 
a great poem. Here they come. <laughs> they probably want to turn around when they see what I have to do for them to do today. <laughs> Y'all meet oh, Richard. Oh, this is Richard. Can you say hey to the folks? What? Can you tell them hey? What? Tell me your name. Look at Leia. <laughs> this is Richard. Richard is blind. Come on, Richard. I'm helping him get into the education center. Come on, buddy. We're, we're going to go in here and sit down, and we're going to love on some bunnies. Watch out. You got a step right here. There you go. Perfect. Let's walk on in. Okay, there's a step. Be careful, step. Perfect. Take your other foot. There you go. Okay, we're going to walk and sit on a couch, and I'm going to need some help with you grooming my bunnies. Can you brush them? Hmm? You wanna hold a bunny? Bunny. A bunny, that's right. It's a bunny or rabbit. Yep. You know what color it is? It's gray. Oh, I'm so, oh, turn, go to the right a little bit. All right, come on in. It's like at the farm. Yep, you're at the farm. So you wanna know what animals I have at the farm? What animals do you think are at the farm? Chickens. Chickens. What else? Dog. Dogs. I do have two dogs. Yeah. Cats. I have two cats. Dogs. Yes, I have those. Turkey. Turkeys. Turkeys. Rabbits. Rabbits. What goes moo? Yeah. A cow. <laughs> That's right. Bull. Bull. You know what my bull's name is? Do you remember? Meh. What goes ba? Billy goats. Billy goats. And horses. I don't have horses. I'm scared of them. But I have something that's similar to a horse. It kicks and says, hee haw, hee haw. Donkey. Donkey. What goes? Oh, a pig. A pig. I have three pigs. Uh, what spits? Do you know an animal that spits? What? An animal that spits? Mm -hmm. Alpaca. Alpaca. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. I have pigeons. Take a cat on. Yes. Roosters that crow. Roosters that crow. I have all kinds of animals. You want to go help me with them? After we finish inside the education center, we'll get to go outside and pedal. Does that sound like a good idea? Don't you have any sex? Huh? Don't you have sex, don't they? Yes. What's that you got? Well, here's Judy. Hey, Judy. Hey. You have such a beautiful name. What's that you got? How about Judy, Judy? Judy, 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 Judy. You know who says that? Yeah. Gomer Paul goes, Judy, 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 Judy. Uh, <laughs> Judy, Judy's going to get some drinks for the um, group home. So one of their favorite things to do at my farm is get a drink. Judy, why do you like to get a drink at my farm? Diet Coke. You like Diet Coke? Do you just like to come get a drink? Is it because they're so cold in my cooler? Yeah. I figured that was it. So the Cokes, I don't know why, but my refrigerator gets gets the Cokes kind of slushy. And so everyone that comes to my farm begs for a drink because they're slushy. So they just got here and they're like, can I have a drink? So Judy and I are going to be little um, entrepreneurs and going to get everybody a drink. Yeah video and I have like literally the worst clothing on the planet. We're farm girls, JC. Yeah, I know. She's a little crazed right now because we've been in this cage, but when she was real little, we held her a lot. And so usually in the afternoons, I'll go in the enclosure and I'll grab her and hold her for a minute. Get out. Okay, bye. It's okay. It's okay. This is my pheasant's baby. You guys want to pet her? I'm going to hold her, but you guys can pet her. I'll pet her. Yeah, it's okay. Did you find? No. Is it? 
Your hands are cold. Oh, I was like, wow. This this is Leroy. These are my followers that love you. Why is Willard out here by himself? I don't know. Uh, we better get on Willard. Why are you out here by yourself? Get who? Buddy. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Buddy. So, do you remember why we started calling each other Leroy? No. <laughs> we just started calling each other Leroy. So, she, as soon as she sees me, what do you say? Leroy. <laughs> We're headed to get um, Richard a Dr. Pepper. Dr. Pepper? Yes, we forgot Richard's Dr. Pepper. Hi. How you doing, friend? Do you know who that is? Who is that? That's my stepdad. Your stepdad? Uh-huh. That's Larry. Can you say, hey, Larry? Hi, Larry. Yeah. <laughs> what? Let me tell you something. Let me get over here. You know why I call you Leroy? Why? Because Leroy's real name is Bad Bad Leroy Brown. <laughs> okay? And you're Bad Bad Leroy Brown because when I ask you what you want to drink, what did you tell me the other day? Coke. No. Diet. No. Sprite. No. Be a beer. Yeah, beer. <laughs> a beer. She's, she wanted a beer at my house. So she's bad, bad Leroy Brown. Me bad? Yes, you're bad. Let's go get the Richard. Yes, you're bad. Coke. You're Let's bad, go. bad Leroy Brown. Let's go get Richard his coke. Do you get some more candy or not? You know what? Mm -hmm. I'll tell you what. You... Stay right here. I'll go get us some candy. Candy? I'm such a sucker. I took all the candy out of my, um, <laughs> my education center because it just got to be a... I don't know. I won't get into that now. But I took it out, so now the group home is missing their candy. Oh, shoot. What did I do with the candy? Oh, I put it in the drawer over here. Let me get them some candy. I've got a pocket full of candy. <laughs> when the group home wants candy, you get them candy. Now uh -huh. listen, you're gonna have to work to eat this candy. Does he have to work? What are you gonna do around no. here? Does he, does will he... you will you brush my bunnies? Brush your bunnies? Yes. I can remember you brush them. This candy ain't for free. You gotta work for it. Mm. You know? I mean that for free. You've already drank. Two, no, <laughs> you're on your third drink. That's your candy right there. You're on your third drink and you want candy. So that's you, your candy right there. That's cocoa. That's cocoa. Mm -hmm. Cocoa. Mm -hmm. I don't want to fall. You ain't, you, ain't, you ain't dizzy today? No, I'm not dizzy. I'm so glad. Because you were dizzy last time you were here. I was dizzy last mm -hmm. time. My hands are cold. Your hands are freezing. Yeah. That's why I'm holding them. I'm trying to warm your hand up. This I warm my hand up? Yes. I am. Well, we got to go out here and feed the chickens here in a little bit. To the chickens? Yes. Your chickens? Yep. They got to eat too. You give them some water? We're going to give them some candy. Water. <laughs> water. So the group home is out there hiding rocks for the kids to uh, find them. And the group home actually painted the rocks and there's like a peacock on the rock. So when a kid finds the rock, if they find the peacock rock, let's say, I'm gonna get them to tell me facts that they learned about the peacock. But he did not want to go outside. What are you wanting? What, what? are you? What are you wanting? Oh yeah, a chocolate, <laughs> flies brownie. Okay. He wants chocolate. I thought you said you wanted something else that was non-dairy. None there. What? It's a chocolate flowers brownie. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. But what do you want on that chocolate fudge brownie? That's non-dairy. Is it, is it 
Chocolate fudge. Chocolate fudge. I thought you said you wanted ice cream. Yeah. So we're staying inside because he didn't want to hide the rocks because he would rather have ice cream. So I told Richard that I would stay indoors with him and we didn't have to go out there and hide rocks. Hey, Richard. What? Would you help me brush the rabbit? What? Do you want to help me brush the rabbit? Yeah. Okay. Okay, Leroy, you go to the bathroom. Okay. First of all, I want you to feel the rabbit. What rabbit is it? The... This is Lulu. Do you feel it? You feel how soft it is? What? Here, take your hand like this and feel how soft it is. You feel? Mm -hmm. What's it feel like? So, it feels like a hair. A hair, okay. All right, now I'm gonna give you this brush. Hold the brush. Hold it in your hand. Now, where you were petting, you're going to brush. So, the reason we brush the rabbit is so that they don't get tangles. Just like you, well, I would say the way you brush your hair, but Richard, you don't have any hair. So, feel it. Now, brush her. There you go. Brush it back and forth. See how much you're helping me? That's the one that had got eggs. Um, this isn't a chicken, this is a rabbit. A rabbit? Yeah, it's not a chicken. Look, feel, here, let me have the brush. You feel her ears. Feel her ears, see how yeah. different? Yeah. You feel the ears? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Feel her? Don't, 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 uh, this rabbit, don't the brain. They have some eggs. No, rabbits don't lay eggs. Yeah. Uh-uh. Mm -mm. Those are chickens and ducks and turkeys lay eggs. And peacocks lay eggs. Oh. Mm-hmm. What he was trying to tell me That's is it. that the Easter bunny brings Easter eggs. And I said, you know what? You're right. What else does the Easter bunny bring? Joe, you be nice to be calm. bring you can get uh, marshmallow lollipops. Marshmallow lollipops. What else did you get in your Easter basket? What? What else did you get in your Easter basket? Oh, yeah, chocolate candy. Chocolate candy. What? It winds up. I think she likes you, Rachel. Her name is Layla. She's just yeah. a baby. She's she doesn't like holy like anybody. Look, that bunny's just sitting in her lap, <laughs> so calm. No. Richard. Oh. He knows that you called him the Easter bunny. Can you feel him again? Can you pet him? There you go. Pet him. Yeah, I'll let you hold it in just a minute, Rhonda. Come on. I'll let you hold yeah, the rabbit. Uh, of yeah. Easter bunny cake. No. Easter bunny cake? No, mm -hmm. Easter bunny don't have a cake. But Rachel. you know what? My my grandmother used to make me an Easter bunny cake. Yeah. It was shaped like the Easter bunny. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is that what you had your mama do that? Yeah. <laughs> Mine did too. Will you sing that again? You did so well. I want you to sing it again. Can uh, I have a uh, seat? It's a nursery rhyme. Okay, sing it again. Hickory, Dickory, Dock. They're mad for not the clock. What? Down the clock just run down your room. Hickory, Dickory, Dock. That is so good, Richard. Who what? taught you that song? It's okay. That was my mother. Your but mother? It was a nursery rhyme. Uh huh. Well, I you did good singing that. How'd you remember that? Yeah. Did you sing it all the time when you were a kid? Yeah. Mm-hmm. I was a kid. All right, Rhonda. Yeah. Me. Can you can you hold? Do you remember her name? Yeah. This is Sugar Book. Yeah. Can you hold it? Yeah. You can hold Sugar Book. How? Put in your put her in your hands. 
There you go. Um, but her head right here. Come on. Okay. Here's the brush. Yeah. Now you can brush her. Brush her slow. Yeah. There you go. Slow. Slow. There you go. I'm going too hard. Good job, Rhonda. Yeah. Yeah. Can you say hey? Yeah. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. You're doing good. Mm -hmm. You brushed your hair. Yep, you're doing a good job. You, that's your favorite, isn't it? Yeah. I knew it was. Yeah. You're so calm when you have rabbits. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. I think you need a rabbit at home. Would you sleep with it? <laughs> yes. It's officially time for midnight to go meet the other ducks because it's too stinky in here. He's big enough, look at him, to go meet the other ducks. I'm going to put him in there with Quacky Jacky and Church to begin with until he learns where home is. So let's go put him and introduce him to his friends. I think, I think she's pretty happy. What do you think? Oh, look at that baby. Oh my goodness. Midnight. You're a duck. You're not a turkey. She's so happy. I want to see if she can jump out of it. I've got to put clean water in here. It rained last night, so it's a little. You a good girl. Yes, you are. Let me go get the water hose. We're filling up the other dock pond as soon as the water's. Filled up in the duck pond, I'll come give you some fresh water. But you got to meet your two friends. Chirps and Quacky Jacky. Look how happy. Oh, goodness. I'm going to go ahead and stop the water in the big, the big duck pond. It's, it's almost full. Let me show you. So I can give her clean water. But, see... They're good. If it rains, it'll fill up a little bit more, but I'm gonna go get the water hose and take it and give them some fresh water. She wasn't sure about her new friend. Chirps is so gentle, so I know they'll get along fine. So I, what I'll do is leave her in here for a couple of weeks, probably just a week to be exact. Once she learns where her home is, then I will begin to free range her out here with the other animals. And then she'll sleep in this coop at night. But once you lock them in for a couple of days a week, they learn real quick that when it's nighttime to come to get in the bed. It's really kind of cool to watch it. Yeah, let's see what he thinks. Oh, midnight. He looks so happy. Taking a little bath. <laughs> Look at him. Oh, he loves it. sweet. I'm so glad he likes it. Now to introduce him to Chirps and Quacky Jackie. Quacky Jackie's laying an egg right now, but Chirps is right there. So I'll let her swim for just a little bit by herself, and then I'll slowly go introduce her. Look at that. She's so happy. getting to be a duck. Oh, makes me so happy. Well, she hadn't jumped out yet. That's your friend Chirpsy. Can you say hey to Chirpsy? Huh? Oh, goodness. 
chirps once out. <laughs> Look who's playing mama. <laughs> to, oh my gosh. Quacky Jackie, are you a mama now? Huh? You got midnight? <laughs> These are sweet. Look at midnight. Over there by her mommy. Oh my god, Dice. That's the sweetest thing ever. Dexter's getting a spank. <laughs> Dexter? Dexter? Dexter Snake, your daddy is fixing to have a fit. Look what Dexter did. <laughs> Uh, Dexter decided to tear down the fence. Oh, he just made his own little walking space, right? Dexter, Dee's gonna be so mad at you. Why'd you do that? You knocked down both the fences, buddy. Your daddy's gonna be so mad. Do you care? I didn't think so. I didn't think you cared. I didn't think you cared, buddy. Afraid Dexter's gonna need Dexter's gonna need some foster care. <laughs> Cause when Shane sees that, he's gonna be livid. Come here, Skipper. Come here, Skip. Skipper. They're all waiting to be fed. They're like, get off the phone and come eat. Come feed me. Let's go over here for Skipper. Skipper. Hey, buddy. Hey. I love you. I do. I love you. Yes, I do. Your daddy's gonna get a spanking. You wanna lick me? You wanna lick me? Your daddy's gonna... Oh, no. He's gonna break that one. Does he not know that we put this scratching post right here? so that he wouldn't sc scratch on the fence. I don't think he's getting it. Your daddy's gonna get in trouble. <laughs> Let's see if I can get Skipper to kiss me. 